Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Motivation for Young Christians. Welcome back, welcome back. Welcome back to another episode of Bible Study, episode 47. Today we're going to be going into John chapter 20, verses 19 to 23. Jesus appeared to his disciples. To begin, we're going to start off with a prayer by me. We'll be led by me today, and then the end of prayer will be led by me. If you guys can, just please bow your heads, close your eyes. Heavenly Father, we thank you, we praise you, we worship you, God. I pray that now from the end this time your word, God. I pray that you will bless and cover the word, God. I pray that we will be able to understand and comprehend what your word is saying and be able to get a good message from it, God. I pray that the audience will get the same message or a different message or message to be able to use, God. We pray that you continue to be in us, God. We pray that I will be able to sharpen iron, God. In Jesus' name, holy name, amen. Now we get into the reading for today. We'll be reading from John chapter 20, verse 19 to 22. NLT version as usual. Verse 19 said, That Sunday evening, the disciples were meeting behind locked doors because they were afraid of the Jewish leaders. Suddenly, Jesus was standing there among them. Peace be with you, he said. Verse 20. As he spoke, he showed them the wounds in his hand and his side. They were filled with joy when they saw the Lord. Again, he said, Peace be with you. As the Father has sent me, so I'm sending you. Then he breathed and he breathed into them and said, Receive the Holy Spirit. If you forgive anyone's sin, they are forgiven. If you do not forgive their sin, they are not forgiven. Now I'll begin into my thoughts for today. The disciples had a meeting behind locked doors because they were afraid of the Jewish leader, uh, which was which is common back then, the Jews could have put fear into um, a lot of people. And Jesus came and meet with them while they were in the meeting. Jesus revealed his womb unto them to show them that he was with it. And his disciple was very, very happy by this. And I believe the purpose why Jesus showed the womb is for them to like more like believe. Because I'm pretty sure this was a shock to them that our our Jesus just died now he's he's awoken he's he's back walking he's alive but he, he fulfilled the scripture because the scripture said that he will um rise up and here Jesus gave his disciple the Holy Spirit which was taking the place of him Jesus mentioned this early in the scripture that this was going to happen Jesus can no longer be with them physically but he'll be with them spiritually but the Holy Ghost is in you to be able to guide you and help you make the wise uh, decision. And also a key verse, which is coming from the last verse, verse 23, um, where it says, if you forgive anyone's sin, they are forgiven. If you do not forgive them, they are not forgiven. And forgiveness is very important because if you want the Heavenly Father to forgive us, we have to forgive others. Uh, I know it's hard. Forgiveness is hard. Uh, sometimes in certain situations and that's why we have God to be able to go to him to be able to ask him to help us do this uh I've struggled with forgiveness uh myself but I'm getting I'm getting way I'm getting better at it to not only forgive others but also forgiving myself because it's very both are very important forgiving others and yourself because you don't want to torture yourself with something you have done you don't want to torture somebody else with something that they did so forgiveness is very important i i want that this message to come out to everybody today forgiveness is very important uh forgive yourself forgive others and just god help through the process and remember that that the holy spirit came here to guide us and put us in the right direction because jesus wouldn't be physically with us Anymore. Now we get into closing prayer for today. Heavenly Father, we thank you. We praise you. We worship you, God. We thank you for this day that you've made. I rejoice again, God. We pray that remember the key message of today, God, that forgiveness is important. To forgive yourself and forgive others, God. I pray that you continue to be with me each and every single day, God. I pray that this upcoming week that your hands bless and cover every single body they're going in and they're coming out god we pray that we're going to continue to dig deep in your word god to learn more god for i to be able to sharpen iron god we love you and we thank you god in jesus name, holy name amen this is it for the video guys thank you guys for coming back each and every single week to continue to learn more about the god to continue to read these bible study with me thank you guys for coming along this journey we're almost at episode 50 um today we're at 47 
just three more episodes from 50 but we're gonna continue to go continue to learn and you guys come along on this journey with me if you had already make sure you hit the thumbs up subscribe if you're new turn on your post notification that way anytime i upload youtube will send you a notification this is motivation for young christian i'll see you guys next week